When most of us think of skin cancer, we think of moles. Well, check out this photo. It's a 17-pound liver wow. tumor. The patient went to the doctor complaining of pain in her abdomen, and after a lot of testing and even surgery, the doctors discovered this 17-pound tumor growing in her liver was actually initially from melanoma. Oh. Even more disturbing, the patient had had her moles checked regularly, and any mole testing always came back clean. Very confusing to hear the story, and back now is dermatologist Dr. Sonia Batra to explain so, so unfortunately, it happens less than 2% of the time that you'll have a metastasis like this or a spread elsewhere to an organ. And the problem is sometimes we can't find the primary in this particular case. And there are a couple of reasons that might happen. One is that when the moles are changing, sometimes your body mounts an immune response to it. And that's called regression, where the pigment starts to fade out. And you might even see a halo around the mole. Mm. So we often talk about changes in moles, and people think of darkening or jagged edges. But if you see a mole that you've had for a long time fading and starting to really kind of become much lighter, that's sometimes a, a sign that the body's reacting to it. It could be But a some of those malignant cells pain. have maybe already metastasized and, they could have already and seeded spread. in the liver. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. Another time is when people pick or scratch at a bleeding or changing mole, and the mole itself sort of sloughs off, but it's already spread. And then the third time is mm. that there are pigment cells elsewhere than the skin. It's very rare, but you can have them in your eyes. You have melanocytes. You have them in the ear. And sometimes those can be the source of these unknown Intense. primary. Yeah, so, so less than 2% of the time, there's an unknown source, but you do get this met metastatic melanoma. Wow. So is that just... In many ways, then just bad luck. And I think that prevention, you know, melanoma is 100% curable if you catch it early. So I try to tell my patients 50% of melanoma come up out of the blue. So if you get a weird new spot that doesn't match anything else, that's certainly something to keep on your radar. And then 50% of the time, if you see a mole changing, whether it's getting lighter, which is, I think, the regression that people sometimes miss, which can sometimes be the most deadly, or it's becoming darker or more jagged, it's something to watch for. Prevention. Wow. Prevention, yeah. prevention, sunscreen, why? brimmed hats, sunglasses, and don't forget about the hands and the feet because we know that malignant melanoma can hit there as well.